guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a Makeup Geek haul for you guys. Beauty Bay recently did 50% off Makeup Geek, which is amazing because Makeup Geek rarely ever has sales. So to get 50% off Makeup Geek was amazing and I was definitely taking advantage of that opportunity. So I did buy a lot of stuff. Like, I mean a lot of stuff. Enough stuff for me to recommend you guys go get a cup of tea or coffee or a snack or something because there is so much stuff. I've got my snacks. I've got some tiny teddies. I love these so much. So I highly recommend you get some snacks as well. Okay, so starting off, I did pick up four brushes just because I've heard great things about their brushes. So the first one that I got was their face buffer brush, which looks like this. To be honest, I do not know why I didn't buy more brushes, but whatever. So I got that brush here. I really like this brush. I haven't used it yet because I did want to haul it before I started using it. But it just looks like it's been designed really, really well. I like how it comes to a tapered tip. And it just it's really, really comfortable to hold in the hand, especially to buff into the face. Then I also bought this round blush brush, which I probably will not be using for blush because, well, that's it compared to my face. I'll probably be using it for contouring. But that's that. I also got the angled stippling brush, which isn't really a stippling brush. It's more like an angled buffer brush, in my opinion, but whatever. And then I also got the foundation stippling brush, which again isn't a traditional stippling brush. I'd say it's like a flat top kabuki brush, in my opinion, but whatever. So the next product that I got, I didn't actually buy at the sale. This is one of the very few products that I didn't buy at the sale. This is the Utopia Pigment. And this is what it looks like swatched on my hand. This is just a dry swatch, but I'm assuming that when it's actually wet on the eye, it will look 10 times better because right now it looks kind of like a weak swatch. You know what I mean? Anyway, okay, are you guys ready to see all the single shadows that I got? Boom. Yes, I got heaps of them. Okay, don't judge. I'm just going to go through each of them. I'm not going to swatch them just because it's going to take way too long. But if you want to see these in future videos, then let me know. Okay, so the first one is Starry Eyed, which is this one here. Goddess, which is this one. Voltage. Taupe Notch, which I think is the cutest name. Bitten, which I've heard so many things about, so I had to get it. This is Taboo. Oh my goodness, this is gorgeous. I don't know how to say this one. Stealth. S-T-E-A-L-T-H. How do you even say that? Anyway, that's that one. I think this will be amazing, like, as an all, like, a one-color smoky eye. I think this will be amazing. Latte, which is going to probably be, like, my favorite shade ever. I can just tell already. Peach Smoothie. Beaches and Cream, which I heard a lot of good things about, so I'm so excited for this one. Wild West, which is a gorgeous shade, which I haven't really heard anything about. Concrete Jungle, which is, like, a true blue tone gray. I am obsessed with this color. I haven't used it yet, but I can tell that it's going to be one of my favorites. This is Enchanted Forest. I'm obsessed with these dark forest greens, especially just all over the lid and then like an orange shade like to fade it out. Oh my god, I die every time. This shade here is called Motown, which is a gorgeous, gorgeous blue-based purple. Twilight. Sin City. Oh my god, this shade is gorgeous. Typhoon which is a gorgeous light green. Jester, this one is gorgeous. Oh my God, I cannot wait to do like a black smoky eye and then just put this like either on the lower lashes or just in the center. Ooh, I can just, I can feel it already. Mesmerized. Ritzy, this one reminds me of Sumptuous Olive from MAC. This one's called Steampunk. Homecoming, which I think I already have. I'm not too sure. Maybe I already have this. Frappe, which I can tell will be a new favourite of mine as well. Morocco, oh my goodness, the amount of things I've heard about this shadow. <laughs> Americano, which looks stunning. Friendzone, Desert Sands, Preppy. And this one does look very, very similar to the last one, but it's not. That's them two to compared. So this one's Desert Sands, this one's Preppy. This is Tiki Hut, oh my goodness, I think I'm going to love this shade as well. Chickadee, I heard so many things about this shadow, so I needed to get it. Brownie points, cupcake, Barcelona beach, cherry cola, dirty martini, petal pusher, bedrock, karma. I think I'll be using this one a lot. <laughs> Roulette, venom, havoc. Is that how you say it? Havoc, 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 havoc. I don't know. H 
A V O C. And this color is absolutely stunning. Cosmopolitan, this shade gives me life. It's Secret Garden, like, oh my goodness. <laughs> Moon Dust, Houdini, which is a gorgeous navy foiled shadow. Then I also got this Z palette worth as well. This is an extra large Z palette. And now we'll just go through the remaining shadows. Ocean Breeze, which is a gorgeous blue shade. White Lies, which is a matte white. I'm Peachless, which I think is a cute name. Bada Bing, Galaxy, which I think is stunning, Center Stage, Masquerade, Daydreamer, Whimsical, In the Spotlight, Charmed, Fantasy, Sensuous, Envy, Burlesque, Ice Queen. This is a contour shade in the shade Love Triangle. It's a warm porcelain contour. And I also got the contour shade Infidelity, which is a cool, fair contour shade. Oh my goodness, guys, that took forever. I'm not even joking. But thank you guys for sticking out till the end. I hope you guys enjoyed. Definitely let me know down below what colors you would like to see in future tutorials and stuff like that. Or one that just caught your eye that you would really, really like to see in an upcoming tutorial. Let me know in the comments down below or even get in contact with me on Snapchat, Instagram or Twitter. I'm just the happy Laura on there. And yeah, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Please remember to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye.